Kim Kardashian is exposed for turning Tristan into Pete to use him to ruin Kanye and Bianca's marriage. I'm always so fascinated by the Kardashians' relationships to men. Kim and Tristan specifically have this little back and forth buddy buddy relationship and I just think it's weird. <laughs> I just think it's really strange. Kim and Tristan just give me weird vibes. Like, I don't know what it is. The Kardashian Jenner empire knows how to keep us hooked with their larger than life stories. The clan is no stranger to rumors and scandals, but this one takes the cake. Kim Kardashian and Tristan Thompson were partying together in Miami on Friday night. After dinner, they went to the club Live in Miami and partied together in DJ Khaled's booth. I guess as time goes on, Kim and Tristan's friendship just grows stronger. Kim Kardashian has allegedly turned Tristan Thompson into none other than Pete Davidson to use him as a pawn in her quest to ruin Kanye and Bianca's marriage. People on social media are surprised that they're hanging out. This person says Tristan and Kim in the same box? No way. But again, they've spent quite some time together at this point. Another person shared some pictures of Tristan and Kim spending time together. They say, why is Kim always with Tristan and supporting him? Kim Kardashian is the queen of the reality TV and a master of steering up controversy. She's no stranger to being at the center of attention and some fans insist that she has a knack for orchestrating drama but turning Tristan Thompson into Pete Davidson that's a whole new level of manipulation tapping the stranger things that have happened in the Kardashian world but I'm saying if you told me that Kim and Tristan flirt with each other secretly I would believe you like no questions asked I would believe you <laughs> They're Strap yourselves, y'all, because on this one, you're going to need water. Is Kim Kardashian trying to make history repeat itself? You all remember her time with Pete Davidson, which created a love triangle that was a fascinating web of celebrity intrigue, their relationship and the speed at which it has progressed. Kim filed for divorce from her then-husband Kanye West earlier in 2021, and shortly after rumors of her dating the comedian started swirling, and now the rumor mill started churning that Kim Kardashian allegedly used Pete Davidson as a pawn in her game of romantic chase to make Kanye West jealous, a classic move straight out of the Hollywood playbook where emotions and egos collided in a worldwide of attention-seeking tactics. Fans also believe she strategically placed herself in a company of the actor knowing full well that the media frenzy would ensue. After all, both Kim and Pete were no strangers to the paparazzi's lens and their combined star power undoubtedly created a spectacle. At first, he was a rebound and she was very open about that. Pete wanted to get with Kim right when she and Kanye divorced pretty much. Apparently, looks like Kim Kardashian is still playing her games only with a different toy and that is Tristan Thompson. The relationship the relationship between the two is an interesting one, filled with drama, controversy, and family dynamics as it goes from great spite from Kim after Tristan cheated on Chloe to the both being seen together so much recently. The last two photos are from last night. It's getting weird. Mind you, neither Chloe nor her daughter be spotted out with him, but Kim be taking herself and her kids everywhere with him. Do I think it's a little weird? Yes. But I guess I want to say this has turned into like a Scott Disick situation, but given the amount of times Tristan has betrayed Chloe, I just don't know if I could forgive him like this. The first two hit rock bottom when news broke out that Tristan had cheated on Chloe while she was pregnant with their daughter Chu. There's video of Tristan making out with a girl last night. I know, Chloe's gonna die. I mean, I can't even imagine being in Chloe's shoes. This scandal rocked the Kardashian Jenner family, and Kim was quick to express her disappointment and anger toward Tristan. When the whole world is looking at you, laughing at you, calling you every name in the book, do you know how hard that is? That is 10 times harder to stay in a situation than it is to leave. In true Kardashian fashion, Kim didn't hold back. However, as time has passed on, it seems that the star has softened her stance towards her sister's ex-boyfriend. She's been seen attending basketball games and events where Tristan is present, showing that she might be willing to give him a second chance. However, the shift in attitude has raised eyebrows and sparked speculations about a possible reconciliation between the two. Do I think it's a little weird? Yes. But given the amount of times Tristan has betrayed Chloe, I just don't know if I could forgive him like this. 
And for some fans, it is way more than just a reconciliation as tabloids have been quick to speculate about a potential romance or secret affair between the two which has only added fuel to the fire. Interestingly, all this is happening shortly after Kim Kardashian reportedly tried to sabotage Kanye and Bianca's marriage. Fans believe Kim Kardashian has been strategically trying to break Kanye and Bianca apart in the instances where she broke down in an episode of The Kardashians, saying she would do anything to have the old Kanye back, which made fans believe she was indeed trying to reach out to him. According to Kendra Capalbo, a licensed couples therapist, she says it might be so difficult for Kim to see Bianca receiving the version of Kanye that she had expressed a desire to have back, a more stable version. Kim has publicly acknowledged the challenges and emotional turmoil of the last few years of their relationship and she might feel envious that Bianca seems to be experiencing a more balanced side of Kanye similar to the person Kim initially fell in love with, adding that it could also be challenging for Kim Kardashian to hear people close to Kanye stating that Bianca is the best thing for him. She grounds all this considering Kim's past comments about being Kanye's cleanup crew throughout their relationship, so it might be difficult for her to witness someone else seemingly becoming a better match for her ex-husband who in this case is Bianca. There is a lot that has rooted Kim's jealousy, like the great relationship that North has with Bianca. Sources revealed Kim thinks Bianca is getting too close to her daughter. She's definitely jealous of North and Bianca's relationship. Reportedly, Kim had strict rules for Bianca when she first started spending time with her kids. And according to sources, she sent a message through her team to Kanye's team, basically saying congratulations and given that it looks like Bianca may soon become a stepmom to the kids, she would like to have a sit down to get to know her in a private meeting. Reportedly, Kim has desperately been trying to hook up with different men just for Kanye's attention and unfortunately, all of them have turned her down with the recent one being Tom Brady. Well, according to the rumor mill, whispers began circulating that Tom and Kim were more than just acquaintances. Speculations ran wild, fueled by anonymous sources and paparazzi snapshots. The media frenzy reached its peak when tablets published headlines claiming that the two were romantically involved. But just when things were heating up, Tom Brady stepped in through his representatives to set the record straight that he had nothing to do with Kim Kardashian. But Kim is not about to give up yet as fans now believe she's using Tristan Thompson instead. Their relationship has definitely raised a few eyebrows and sparked some creepy vibes among fans and critics alike. So if I were in that family, Tristan would be getting a slight head nod at Thanksgiving and Christmas. At most. Tristan is the ex-boyfriend to Kim's young sister. This alone adds a layer of complexity to their relationship as it's not exactly the most conventional situation. One would expect some level of discomfort or awkwardness, but that doesn't seem to deter Kim. She's been openly showing love to her sister's cheating baby daddy, Tristan Thompson, more than once. Now, considering Kim used to be Tristan's biggest hater, you can understand why her public love for him is receiving some mixed reviews. Some fans believe that Kim's interest in Tristan stems from her protective nature towards her sister as she feels she needs to keep an eye on him, especially considering his past infidelity and the heartbreak he caused Chloe. However, the way she goes about it can come across as rather unsettling. Kim has been known to engage in friendly interactions with Tristan on social media media, leaving comments and liking his posts. While this might seem harmless, it does raise some questions about boundaries and loyalty within the family. Some fans find it strange that she's seemingly supportive of someone who hurt her sister deeply. The two were recently spotted in Miami hanging out as usual, but what is upsetting fans is that the two seems to be wearing coordinated outfits, which is seemingly becoming a habit as fans have noticed it's becoming trendy for the two. They were also spotted at Lionel Messi's first game as an intro Miami FC and later Kim and Thompson hit up LIV nightclub together when 
where they parted late into the night. The two have been seen around each other regularly as she in one stains held a hand-painted sign that read Tristan Thompson as she and North sat courtside for the basketball players game against the Golden State Warriors. They even visited a Los Angeles juvenile detention facility to eat with young men ahead of the national holiday. All this is reportedly being done by Kim Kardashian to prove to Kanye West that she's learning to let go. So is Tristan only a puppet and Kim is the puppeteer? Using a new romantic interest to provoke an ex-partner is not an entirely unheard of tactic in the realm of celebrity breakups. With Kim and Pete's relationship, we saw he got tattoos of her kids in addition to him living with all of them under the same roof, which of course made Kanye act out because he wanted to protect his children just like he's doing with Bianca at the moment. But the only difference is she portrayed Kanye to be this jealous lunatic who was out to prey on her new relationship with Pete Davidson. The Kardashians are masters at turning challenges into opportunities. They have a knack for leveraging controversies and turning them into publicity gold. So, while Kanye's marriage has brought occasional hurdles, the Kardashians have shown that they know how to use these situations to their advantage, keeping their fame intact. And as for the Tristan plot twist, the fans are not seemingly pleased with one even saying that he most likely will make a move on Kim. Chloe is going to kick herself when Tristan makes a move on Kim and she accepts because she's going through a middle-aged crisis. With another adding, I have a problem with my sister hanging out with somebody who literally ruined my mental health. With the third one adding, I'm not understanding why Kim Kardashian would be hanging with Tristan, especially after all his deception with Chloe. It don't make sense. But what is your opinion on this new development in the Kardashian storyline? Share with us your thoughts down below in our comment section and please do not forget to like, subscribe for more exciting plots.